All right, well, hey, we are now in losers' finals. Awaiting, I'm pretty sure what is Ape Man Man versus J Mafia. I'm gonna go commentate all time. You sure? Yeah. Okay. Okay, I can't see right now. Hold on. I will. Give me one second, guys. Set this really quick for me, and I'll be right back. Okay, I don't know, chat. What do you guys think? Do you guys think Yoshi wins the matchup? That's what I'm curious. I feel like it's a win. Oh, we're talking Yoshi, Rob. I thought we were still talking Yoshi. Yoshi Ness. Uh, I don't think this is even. I, I think it's. I think it's Rob Faber. I think it's another Rob Faber matchup. Rob has a lot of the tools to contest Yoshi in the air. He has the ability to shut down Yoshi. On the ground. Safe phones are no joke. Three, this is the first time I've seen this matchup, so this is good. Well, we'll see how things play out here so far. Off the bat, though, Jay Mafia being very, very aggressive. I think the one thing about that's really tough. Ape Man is a tough cookie to crack. I'm not gonna lie, like, he is not afraid to just go for a lot of options because he knows Rob's toolkit very, very well. Coming as a Rob main all the way from Smash 4. So he is, he definitely knows what to do. Look at that, off the neutral into the back air, and Yoshi is gone. That's a tough spot to be in. That's what I'm telling you, like, I think it's just Rob's as a whole. Just takes down Yoshi. Yoshi wins easy. I don't know, man. Looking like Rob right now, but we'll see. We'll see. I I'm not 100% sure. I think when I look at Rob, it's the toolkit. I think it's Rob for sure. Rob is a big hitbox, though. Hurtbox, I'm sorry. I think we're, the one thing maybe Yoshi might accelerate is maybe offstage. Wow. And it doesn't matter if he armored through that because Ape Man had enough time to come back and grab him. Oh, yeah, he, he caught him in the middle of back there. Yeah, he armored. He, he armored. Yeah, I was gonna say. Careful. Yeah, I was gonna say, for Ape Man, he's gotta watch out. Good downer. He knew when he had enough time to go for that, just because he had that situation. J Moffin might have been trying to go for another. I, I, but that was still a good downer. Really, really weird to see a Tombstone Pile Driver that'll do it. With a platform extension, this man is out of here. Wait for the land leader? Nice. He doesn't even need to catch the lining, he just needs to see if J Mafia is either gonna go for the lining on the stage or go for the lining at the edge, and even then going for the laser reward. Or throwing out Gyro to try to force Yoshi to pick a ledge option. 
no. That was tough on him. He... He tackled... Which in this situation where he didn't really need to? It's hard to it's hard to see matchups and see in a world where like you win the matchup just because the character is easy. It's something you have to factor. It could just be the way that the opponent plays it. So it could be possible that yes, this maybe is a matchup that Yoshi wins. It's just the way that Ape Man is playing it is makes it really hard for J Moffat to deal with. It, it's it's different. Definitely different. He snuck them back at the very last second, just when J Moffat can find he can throw eggs for free. Yeah, no, that's no, it's, it's okay, Arcane. It, it, it's hard. It's hard to see you how matchups work when the opponent is losing. A really good example that I tell people is like, look at Elegant. There are a lot of matchups Luigi loses. It's just Elegant's playstyle is very keen on, it's okay. I know what to do. I know how to fight this matchup as Luigi. So. This is the first time I've ever seen this matchup, so I'm... I know Strides is quiet. You can hear the wind. Zucky's here with me, guys. Shout out to Strides, though, honestly. Go! Haven't seen that guy in French. <laughs> Oh, he, he caught a big man going for another shield off his. Egg lay? That's a really big egg. <laughs> That's all I'm noticing. That's a really big egg. Nice. Caught him in the aerial. Good up air, but Yoshi's actually able to get away. I think he caught him at the tail end of it, too. So he didn't get away. away. No tech. So it's hard to tech online. Comes out with an up air out of shield. Sorry, out of the air. Good, good Robo Gyro. Really good either way. Takes care of Yoshi. And what I meant by up air to shield, I meant up air out of egg. <laughs> nice. Using using back to kind of thrust and stuff away. Careful with the option on the ledge. Really good. And he's able to punch accordingly. Ape Man. I almost got an Ape Man. He he tried to stall himself to try to come back from the speed. The big problem is that he's still in a situation where Yoshi can just kill him with up air. That's what kind of caught him out there. Sometimes it's okay to do it alone. Fighting for some stage can be the cause of many, many stock losses, as we've seen tonight. That's the stock. It's the crazy thing about Rob. Can you imagine if DK could actually do like, well, he can actually do something like Never mind, not important here. Let's go back to the matchup here. Gyro toss into the neutral air. Nice, good laser just to call out the aerial approach here. That's something that you want to do, especially against Yoshi. Like, Yoshi's buttons in the air are really, really good. So if you make him feel uncomfortable for going for aerial approaches, you are ineffectively showing that one of his favorite tools to use. And unfortunately for Ape and Manning's off the stage into Yoshi's big old head. I want to say big old nose, because he hits you with the nose first. And he's out. There, yeah, Ape and Manning now one one apiece against Game Mafia. Kind of one of those things, right? Like I feel like Yoshi's aerials have it's it's easy to call them priority, but it's not really priority. It's just the hitbox is so big, and there's a lot of knockback that it feels like when Rob is off the stage, it's easy. It can be easy pickings for Yoshi, and sometimes Rob doesn't mind being off stage because like he can stall himself, he can throw an aerial. He's okay off stage, but Yoshi is one of those characters that's like, oh okay, you're off stage, fine, go for forward, go for an arrow, <laughs> then that's it, because. Just little big beefy hitboxes that Yoshi has. So we'll see, we'll see. I don't know. It's it's still one of those matchups I'm not really too familiar with. This is the first time I'm seeing it, but putting those things on the paper definitely helps out. Yeah, it looked a lot better for Yoshi. I definitely agree with Young. Looked a lot better for Yoshi. 
speed spell one. <laughs> is that you go you go reference, right? Please tell me that is. <laughs> I love you, Bia. I wish I could I, don't know, I would put that game on on offline so much, but online I don't know like, if I can. I love holding cards in my hands, man. Shout out to you, Bia. It's a great card game. I feel people don't give it enough credit sometimes. It does feel like Yoshi's aerials would definitely have speed spell one. I guess they're discussing stage choices. I think I'm not a Rob main, but in particular, I think Ape Man may want a bigger stage. For sure. I tried to get into that Yu-Gi-Oh! phone game. Where it's like speed goals, but. Uh, not for me. I'm not into phone games anymore. <sighs> Even when I was in high school, phone games are cool. Play something to pass the time in class. Anyways. Three, two, yeah, I was gonna say, there's stage. Go! They benefit Ape Man. He doesn't have to worry about things like Yoshi, Yoshi up air, Yoshi in air, have more space to work around. Yeah. Yo, man, that downfield is just so good. I honestly feel like it's one of the best downfields of the game. I mean, I have to convert it much, but man, is it super safe. Look, I'm gonna be real. I don't. I really didn't think that Yoshi's up tilt would connect after jab. We can talk about a little bit about you in a minute, Young. Yeah, yeah, community, community, the Yuga community's always been weird for me. I've never really I've gotten into it. But I've always enjoyed playing card games with friends. Unsafe on a shield, unsafe on shield. <laughs> that down it does not matter when Rob has <laughs> invincibility from the angel platform. Honestly, when, when I when I tell people when you find invincibility from angel platform, your your best opportunity is just to run away. Be careful where you run, especially when you're in stage like Common City, just because it's a big stage, you don't have to run towards you know disadvantage. But know how to hold it on your own. Nice neutral air lines first here. Gyro. Yoshi may not have to worry about Gyro staying in place, but it's the fact that Ape Man has that extra projectile that against. Yoshi, that just helps him out a lot. It's a big ol' egg, 126 here. He's okay, it's Town City. Big blast zones all around. Nice. Unsafe on shield. No cross up. Do not pass code, do not collect $200. Yoshi is scared. I hate this character. I hate Yoshi. I hate this big old pink dinosaur with big old yellow boots. Oh, let's smash. Can you imagine, dude? Like, you have to tell your friend, like, yeah, man, I lost to a guy who uses a pink dinosaur with yellow boots. That hurts. Big old nose. You can't hate Yoshi, man, because they're just nice people, too. <laughs> That's the worst part. Anyways, even man back on the scene here. 112. The stock is literally his, man. Can this man touch the ground? Nice, nice. Jets away just before he can get hit by forward air. Good spot dodge here. Scary situation there. I felt like J Moffat could definitely get something there. Back back throw. Watch yourself from the landing here. This is coming down to the wire in the last spot here. All Ape Man has to do is get a read, watch the landing. Something here. Nice, nice. Able to maneuver and the tail hit of neutral air, not even enough. This is a thick dinosaur, man. I thought Barney was thick, but Yoshi is even thicker out there. Oh. Yeah, I was gonna say, be careful. Good, good neutral air, good neutral air. He knows, come back, come back towards the ledge. Don't, don't go for single game. You can get super punished. Big blast zones, really good. Doesn't matter. Egg's okay. Rob is fine. Ape it, man. Can you come back towards center stage? But unfortunately, J Mafia lets the back airs whip. I'm just surprised that 
Rob Nair did not kill Yoshi at like 150 plus. I know it's Town and City, but man, that 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 to me was surprising. I don't know about you guys, but if <laughs> I was telling you, man, Yoshi is thicker than that, thicker than Barney. Shouts to all you kids who grew up on public television, by the way. Do you guys even know who that is? In my opinion, both of these characters are broken in their own right. <laughs> real talk. Both of these characters are broken in their own right. I'm gonna be real. Like, they're both very, very broken. Double jump armor is done, but I agree. I agree. I agree. 19th, 22nd heaviest character in the game. I, right? And you, he survived Rob Nair at like 150 plus. Talon City is a factor, but that's like. It's the name of the game, baby. It's the name of the game. Off Yoshi. <laughs> I don't know, man. I mean, there's a reason why we don't see Yoshi at the top level place. The, the, the character does have some shortcomings, for sure. Bob top 10, though? I agree. I most definitely agree. Oh, Yoshi extended his hurtbox with down tilt. That's how that got affected. Okay, I see that. I think I kind of want to see Aether Man kind of stick more center stage and hold stage control. That was something that he couldn't establish much earlier. Oh my god, yo, take this man around every single move. Yeah, I, oh god, careful. I have to agree with Soldier Sleep. He does kind of need it. Like, I, I may hate this character, and there's this character on the ground for all I care, but yeah, he does need something like that. Nice. Lines of the neutral now. Careful on the shield. It's not that quite safe in it. I'm in recovery. <sighs> I hate Rob, but I have to admit, I gotta get put at the Ape and Man and learn how to recover properly. Good laser. Nice. Hold center stage for the control. I like the up tilt. Good anti air. Wall stick catch. Game off you on the slip up. Fight for center stage could be a fight for your life, but also the wall stick for your life. Down slash is not enough. Negative on shield. No parry. I, would, I, I get where Ethan now is going though. <laughs> ah, that's a snipe. I wouldn't even call it a snipe. That's just a long range missile at that point. Hit this man with Unibeam. No, what is it? Though? What's, what's a Cyclops move? <sighs> optic Blast. There you go. Optic Blast. Shoutouts to the voice actor. He just passed away this uh, today. He's been voicing Cyclops for years. Shoutouts to him. Very, very memorable voice if you guys ever played Marvel vs. Capcom 2. Nice, tape it, man. Slowly coming back on the same tech. Oh, no, that's tough attack. That's tough attack. It's because back there has like three hits. Ooh, I like that DI with attack. Could have been, could have been a lot of, could have been death. Just because like Yoshi, if you attack against Yoshi, it's, it's gonna be very punishable. But it's okay, so watch yourself, Ape Man. I was gonna say, Game Mafia was looking for something sneaky here. Don't count him out just yet. Just because you see the percent here doesn't mean Game Mafia can't come back. He did it before. Nice in there. Stage control, corner carry. Gets the egg right. He can still mash. Oh no. Not like this. This soldier sleep was wrong, man. This was looking. See, this looking like game. I wish I could tell you it was game five soldier sleep, but <sighs> J Mafia takes it over Ape it, man. I'm telling you, dude, he was up to something. Like, I could see J Mafia planning something sneaky against Ape Man, and it played out at the very last second. I 
been very much a pressure on that I can tell you, like, that was a bad match. You think Arame would know. <sighs> yeah, it wasn't a good match. He didn't, he, but, like, it's hard. Mm. Situations like that when you're off the stage, like, if you try to match improperly, Yoshi can actually go back down there and then finish you off. So I feel like sometimes mash timing is, is a factor. I've seen it happen before where like somebody will mash out of Yoshi egg leg and then Yoshi just gets another forward and it's okay. So it's 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 really rough. Really, really rough spot. Definitely have to agree it was a bad mash. Um J Mafia co main drop, so oh okay, that, that's <laughs> that explains. That gives the care of the player the knowledge of what to do. See, that was the situation here. It was the last time where he teched that J Mafia felt that, that he wanted to punish him. He like, missed the punish, and then when it comes back to the offstage play here, that's where J Mafia gets that big play he was looking for. Yeah. If you guys got the clip, definitely feel free to post it on the chat. Yeah, mash mashing with stick is way safer. Exactly what I'm saying, like, I agree with Soldier Sleep here, is, yeah, Yoshi can egg again after he mashed. That's where mashing becomes more of a timing thing for you. And Rob has one of those characters that he can definitely mash well. Hey, thank you so much, 8-Bit Man, for the party of 26 rating. Wish I could have seen you in Grands, man. Wish I could have seen you in Grands, but... Then the last one of the best Rob mains out there. Shout out to 8-Bit Man. Definitely hit him a follow, and if you can find the... you see the stream here, 8-Bret Man. Hit that stream with a follow or the sub if you have that extra. I didn't see much lag, but if there was lag, dang, that sucks. Yeah, Abemel is in a tough position. And it's just Yoshi. I'm just telling you, like, Yoshi's, Yoshi's tools. I don't know, man. I hate that character. I hate that character. I hate a lot of characters, but Yoshi, Diddy, Yoshi and Diddy are like at the top of the list. I don't hate Rob that much. I'm sorry, I don't hate Rob or Game and Watch that much. Yeah, Abemel does come from Brawl. Shout out to that soldier sleep. He is definitely a brawl brawl vet. Question in the 8-bit man versus Ven Did you guys lag test or was the solution to set up a private arena because of lag and got worse in the private arena? Um no, they opted to play it off stream and then see how things go from there. Sometimes it's just the connection between three players and a spectator, two players and a spectator, so it's very, very rough, but we just, if they wanted to play off stream, that, that was okay, we, we okayed it. So, them playing off stream might have helped, yeah. I don't know if 